All right, guys, in this quick video, I'm going to show you a plugin that I use on my own blog uh, for Clint's Moneybox. And this plugin is called ClickBump SEO. And this is going to make doing your on page SEO a breeze. It's very easy to use, it's fun, and it's quick. And that's pretty much why I like it. It's very basic, and uh, it tells you exactly what you need to do in order to make your post 100% uh, optimized. Um, if you guys are interested in the plugin, this is the uh, home page for the plugin. I'll leave a link in the description so that you guys can uh, check it out yourself. But I'm going to go ahead and go over to my Clint's Money Box uh, website. And I'm going to go ahead and go into one of these posts that I've created. This is the Invest in Silver, Silver Rounds post that I put on my Clint's Blog World website. Okay, if you look over here to the right, you'll see the ClickBump SEO module. And the first thing that we got to do is put in our keyword into this uh, keyword phrase box and the keyword for this post is silver rounds. And if you scroll down you can see it gives you your keyword density um, it tells you exactly what you need to do in order to make this post 100 percent optimized and as you can see I have to do a couple more things to make it 100 percent optimized and uh, the reason I didn't put an h2 heading in this post is because my title is already an h2 heading this just doesn't pick that up and then I can also add a nofollow attribute to my external links, which I have not done yet. But it's just a very sweet and simple plugin, and it's uh, something that I suggest grabbing if you guys are um, looking to do some hardcore SEO like I do. Um, between Market Samurai and ClickBump SEO, my posts get written really quickly, and it's very easy to um, produce posts that way. Um, another thing this does is if you look under the LSI keyword suggestions and click on the Google Top 10, it'll bring back a bunch of LSI keywords that you can use in this post. And you can see the green keywords are the keywords that I have already used in this post and everything else is just a suggestion and I can add all of these to my um, my tags box uh, where is it? Down here. And if you want to go ahead and add all of this stuff to your tags, all you have to do is click on copy the keywords to tags field and then come down to your tags and then just click on add and it'll add every single one of those keywords there for you. Um, like I said before, you need at least four LSI keywords. You can have as many as you want. And so having a whole bunch is not going to hurt your uh, blog post at all. Um, but just make sure at least four of those LSI keywords show up somewhere inside of your post. And uh, you'll get a better rank that way. So that is basically it for ClickBump SEO. I highly recommend you guys pick this one up and uh, use it. Uh, you'll use it on a daily basis, and it'll save you lots of time and uh, effort. And like I said, it's fun to use as well. So uh, that's basically all I have for you guys today, and I will see you in the next video.